Okay, guys, so we just got here to the pool. It looks like we need um some vacuuming. I don't know if you can see it. See all that, that grass? And it's building up dirt. Now just check the skimmer. You see how the motor sounds? That filter's pretty good. But this filter right here, that's trash in there. Grasshoppers. I'm just gonna check this out real quick. Take this off. Okay, yeah, uh, um, this pool, connect this back here. And it's, you see how the, the, the jet returns real low on pressure? It's because the pH is real high. There you go. Look. And that was just by guessing it because the pressure you can always tell by the pressure of the jet return when it's low pressure on the jet return your, your ph is real high so now you you have to do you have to backwash it and um backwash first you want to vacuum it backwash and then rinse it and then back to filter so check see first check the skimmers you vacuum it you backwash you vacuum you back in with waste and then you backwash and then you rinse and then you back to filter and then see how the water's coming out is because they're splashing water out there's some having some fun out here but yeah and right now i'm gonna take it to another pool i have to go do that and go check that out right now so i'm gonna vacuum this pool tomorrow and i'll be back with you and a little bit to show you the other pool, my other pool service. It right now, um, I'm gonna come back tomorrow. I gotta go do the other service on the other pool. And we'll notify the owner. And so right now I'm gonna take y'all back to, to the other pool that I gotta go check out that they need to clean like today right now. So I'll be back with y'all in a minute. You can see that green? We're gonna get that fixed in a couple of hours. First we have to vacuum the pool, and I'll be back with you after we're done vacuuming. All right, so right now my dad is uh, netting out the pool. I think all the leaves are in here. Yeah, me. And then, and then what are we gonna do after this? After we're done netting? The pool. Then we're gonna vacuum the pool. I have to vacuum the pool in a minute because it has a lot of algae in the bottom, a lot of dirt. Just don't get the house. Okay, this, this is the, the, the different location of somebody else's pool. And they called me like and they needed an urgent cleaning. Because they needed it done by Friday. That muriatic acid, that's what's gonna, that's gonna clear this up real quick. And the shock together. And the pH balance. Pause that. What we're gonna do, we're actually gonna vacuum this pool and throw some water in there. That way we can vacuum it and connect the, the vacuum hose to the skimmer. We actually could, couldn't find it because it was too big. My vacuum hose, so we connected it to the adapter. That way we can connect, uh, the, connect the adapter to the skimmer and uh, adapt it to the water, the hose, to the vacuum, the new one that I got. So now we're gonna, uh, you see, we're gonna clean that filter out, one of those filters, and that one get and turn on the the skimmer, and now we're gonna vacuum. So I'll come back with y'all after we're done, and we're halfway through it. So I'll be back with y'all. All right. Um, we try to vacuum the pool, and the skimmer, we don't know if it's working because it's not even picking up anything from the vacuum. And um, space over here. This this pool, we're gonna so we disconnected it for over here. So we disconnected it and connected it back to see if the filter is actually running and going the way it usually, it, it usually is. We're gonna see if it's sucking the, 
the vacuum if it's sucking the water back into the filter and we're gonna check it out right now i'll be back with you in a minute Pause. all right guys um we actually <laughs> we actually found out what the problem was it's actually the the, the skimmer it has like two of those jets coming out and one the one that sucks it in and we actually have to replace that and only run it in one because the pool like this if it's not running it's not gonna move the chemicals and stuff like that so we're gonna have to add the muriatic acid and the stabilizer and we actually have got a whole case of that the, the, pro, the chlorine pro and uh, for the algae what we're gonna add the muriatic acid is actually gonna clear it up and the protein the pro the protein the pro team this is that for the algae and we're actually gonna add some chlorine like about four of these and we have the the chlorine tub tubs the chlorine pucks uh, that's what we're gonna add right now we're gonna wait till that water fills up that way we don't want to add the chemicals to it and then add water because it's all gonna throw it off so just add the water we couldn't vacuum it because the skimmer is running not even strong enough but I told the man we can run it in one and buy adapters to it and run it in one and they'll be good but as long as you see how the, uh, the skimmer and the return this is birdie coming out, so it's it's okay. It's, and as long as that's running, it's pushing all the chemicals out. So we're gonna have to run this this filter for like at least how it is going, how it is the pressure is going like that. And I have to probably run it all all day and all night to the next day to the next day. And hopefully by then, I know it will it will cure the muriatic acid is gonna cure that up, and that'll be good. I got my child um, over here. Look. You can take all of this off and I actually just brushed it all around and we'll, uh, eventually we're gonna see by probably by tomorrow we're gonna see all the gunk in the middle and hopefully we have to vacuum it and I'll try to take these off these returns and just run the vacuum connect it to the to the filter and run it out through the skimmer and the return jet. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do right now. We're actually just filling, filling it up, like up to a, a little bit more where that blues, like like that, covered up that blue, all that blue spot. And we'll be actually good. This is a new video, it's a new location, a new pool. I'm just helping this guy out because he needs help like real bad because he wants it done by Friday. He wants to get it, get it clear, clear by Friday and it will be good. We're going to add the muriatic acid right now and then the pro team and then the pro uh, chlorine. We're going to actually add four chlorine. Let me see the gallons. Four chlorines. Yes, four gallons. Four gallons of chlorine and one muriatic acid. One gallon of muriatic acid. And then the. Uh, see, like 30 ounces. 40 ounce of the Team Pro. And now we're going to add the chlorine. So I can show your face from a distance, right? Yeah. That's one gallon. Two. Huh? Two. Two what? Two gallons. What do you mean? Two gallons. You already used two of them. You, uh, isn't that one right there? Or is that a different one? Oh, acid. Oh, okay. 
Your number two. Weapon. Got it number two. We need to record long ways. Long ways. Oh. Well, we just need to come out all messed up. Yeah, it's still some Growing them. Nah, actually, it'll just smell weird. It looks like it's coming clear already. Yeah. Looks a little more clear. You're seeing it, I've seen it stay cloudy, but we're gonna need to put, put that uh, the UV shield. And then it won't be cloudy. Right. No, not the UV shield, uh, in the stabilizer. They're having some technical difficulties. You can't even say it. Technical Man, my arms are, man, my hands are burning. I need to pick up my arms. You see? Right there. You sit there like that. And now we're gonna add uh, the team pole, which is for the algae. Polyquat. What? Polyquat. Here we go. So is this stuff like kill the algae or? Yeah, this kills the algae that's building up, but that's already there. Oh. You want me to click pause? Yes. Get out. All right, guys. That's what we did. It's starting to look way better now. 
You see that it's clearing up from the muriatic acid. But yeah, by tomorrow it should be clear, but it's gonna be cloudy still, so we're gonna have to add that UV shield on it. That way, I can keep the clothing inside the pool. And we still need to, it's gonna be pretty hard because um, the, the filter wasn't working to actually vacuum it, man. But tomorrow we'll come, hopefully he'll, he'll buy that stuff to repair the return and the skimmer that way you can vacuum the whole thing up and then we just add some chlorine after we're done but yeah this is a new pool site that I'm doing but yeah all right that's the video for today like comment subscribe more for more videos I'll be back tomorrow to record this and tomorrow to go do the other pool thank you guys now we added all the things to it um it looks like it's, it's clearing up by tomorrow it should be clear already and then we're gonna add uh, the uv shield that way it can um i can hold the, the chlorine in there because it's gonna be cloudy it's clearing up but it's, it's it's gonna be cloudy because of the chemicals we just need that piece over there there's a small piece back there where you can't really tell but yeah everything else is it's looking way better it's like our baby bluish cloudiness and it's working the return is working um and we'll be back tomorrow to put that um the stabilizer that way it can hold the chlorine and hold the chlorine in there and uh for the cloudiness but yeah that's all we need and it looks actually looks way better than it did like way better man so we're not gonna we're now gonna leave the skimmer on for 24 hours and let the chemicals do the rest of the work and we'll be back tomorrow